Welcome to zip9.com. This video tutorial na the ating series on uh, addition of uh, integers. No, uh, from the previous video, pinag-aralan natin that uh, integers can be represented as movement on the number lines. No, or on the number line. So, for example, meron tayong positive one. We can represent it as a movement from zero uh, to uh, the right. No, one unit yon. And then a uh, negative one is also a movement from uh, or one unit to the left. So, pag meron tayong positive one plus negative one, pag kinambayad natin yung dalawang movements na yun, we have to go to the right by one unit and then go to the left by one unit. No? Which is zero. No? So, babalik siya dun sa zero. Kaya, ang one plus negative one ay zero. Ngayon, we can also represent numbers as uh, positive and negative chips. And since positive 1 plus negative 1 is 0, ibig sabihin, pag meron tayong nakitang positive chip na, uh, here we represented positive chip as blue chips, and negative chips as red chips, pag may nakita tayong pares na positive and negative, uh, they will become 0. No? So, for example, here we have 4 plus negative 2. Yung dalawang pares na yan magka-cancel out at matitira yung uh, positive 2. So basically, kung alin yung mas maraming chips, yun yung magiging, yun yung matitira, yun yung magiging sign ng ano natin, no? yung ating uh, uh, sagot. Of course, meron na tayong part 1 sa part you can uh, watch those videos no? before watching this. Kasi medyo advanced na ito, marami na tayong add-ins here. No? Okay, so let's answer our first question. So we have 7, 6, oh, 7 plus 6 plus negative 4. Ang strategy lang, pag more than 2 yung given or yung addends natin, we just have to add first the positive. No? Here we have two positive numbers. We have 13. And then we, before adding to the negative number. No? Okay. So here we have, uh, ano ang magpapares? Apat, di ba? Anong matitira natin? Positive chips kasi mas marami yung 13 kisa sa negative 4. So, 13 plus negative 4, magpaparish yung apat. May matitira tayo na sham na positive chips. No? Okay. What about sa number 2? We have uh, negative 8 plus negative 3 plus 6. Unahin muna natin yung negative kasi mas marami sila. Mas maraming add So, we have uh, negative 11. Meron kang uh, walong negative chips. Meron kang tatlo. So, you have 11 negative chips plus 6, no? positive 6. So, hindi sila magkapareho ng sign. Uh, magpapares yung 6 dito. Ilan ang matitira? Ano ang matitira? Negative or positive? That's negative kasi mas marami to. No? So, we have... Ilan ang matitira? 5, di ba? We have negative 5. So, number 3, we have uh, 10. Positive 10 plus plus itong dalawa, negative 4 tsaka negative 6. Meron kang 4 na negative chips, meron kang 6 na negative chips. Pag kinumbine mo sila, meron kang 10 negative chips. So, ang 10 tsaka negative 10, mukhang eksakto, no? Pag pinagparis-paris natin, kaya mag-cancel out yan sila lahat. And then we will have 0 as our answer. Here we have uh, lahat negative numbers. No? So wala tayong problema. Meron kang pitong negative chips, meron kang tatlo, meron kang apat. So all of them are negative. Kaya add lang natin sila. No? We have uh, negative 14 chips. So negative 14 yung sagot natin. Also here we have all uh, positive numbers, positive integers. So, 14 plus 3, we have 17. At dito, meron tayong uh, ilan yung positive natin. We have 12. Tapos plus, ilan yung negative natin? Meron tayong 6 na negative chips sa isang negative chip. We have negative 7, di ba? Tapos magpapares yung uh, negative 7 dito sa pito na positive 7. Ang matitira natin, ilan? 5, no? 
limang positive chips. Okay? So, no, dalawang observations dito. Una, pagsasamahin muna natin lahat ng positive, pagsamahin natin yung negative. Para magkaroon lang tayo ng dalawang addends, no? I think that's the the best method, no? And secondly, we have, uh, pag meron tayong positive N plus negative N, no? Pagpareho yung number natin, pero magkaiba ng sign. I think that's one observation. So, if we have, uh, for example, 100 plus negative 100, oh, that's, that becomes zero. So, pagpareho sila ng, ng pagpareho silang number kasi magkaiba sila ng sign ito, positive is negative. And that becomes zero. Okay, so I think yan lang yung strategy natin. Pagsamahin natin ang negative, pagsamahin natin ang positive bago natin i-add. No? So maraming salamat. See you in the next tutorial.